Good afternoon, sir. This is Vikan Negi. So my question is very fundamental. Like we all are CSA students. So uh, whenever I am doing coding and I am preparing for those you know competitions, like I get the question like if I am uh, coding it blindly or do I need to make some fundamental changes in my learning process like to cope up with the AI space uh, so that my uh, personal development will be enhanced. So what are those fundamental changes that I need to make uh, with this growing era of AI? First of all. Uh dissect the problem statements really really well right at times this goes back to the very initial point that i made right i think the moment we are confronted with a problem we are trying to get into a solution i, I think as a computer science engineer you should not just think about coding as a means to solve the problem you have to be worried about many different problems right is your code going to be performant enough is it going to scale faster right uh, is is the architecture relevant for all the future releases of all the components that you are using as part of the software? So at times we as coders tend to just code, right? And it's a very unidimensional pursuit that you can code and you can solve problems really fast. But is that code going to stand out in the market, right? Is that is that going to be performant enough? Is, is it a code or a piece of software that you are developing that can be used concurrently by thousands of users at the same time? I think a lot of these dimensions are missed whenever you are participating in competitions and so on. In fact, if I know about this, Kaggle is a platform, right? Where a lot of people participate on AI codes and AI platform, uh, like AI solution development. I think one of the dimensions that they also rank the uh, top teams on is how performant is their code, how fast it can run, right? How many people can use it at the same time. So it's not always about getting the top level of accuracy or solving the problem extremely well, but then not being able to serve to a wide variety of audience. It's okay to solve it 95%, but then be very confident about if 100 and million people of users uh, use it, it won't break down. So I think these are frameworks that you have to be worried about.